Hey guys, welcome back to Racket Champion. My name is Tyler, and today we have a review of the Leaning N90, the fourth edition. So this racket was promoted by many professionals, the most popular ones being Chen Long and Mohamed Hassan. This racket is a part of the Mega Power series, which is a series meant for maximum power for really offensive players. This racket comes with a very special case. It's a thermal racket cover that comes with a really nice futuristic design. Getting into the main technology of this racket, it has 3D brake technology, which reduces windage and increases the racket speed. It is made with the classic leaning military grade carbon fiber and comes officially in the red and gray colorway. It weighs approximately 85 to 89 grams and comes with a medium flex. The overall length of the racket is 675 millimeters. The grip length is 200 millimeters and the bounce point is 292. So you could say this racket is very much a head heavy racket. In terms of stringing, the mains can be strung from 26 to 30 pounds, while the crosses can be strung from 28 to 32 pounds. Grip size is extra small, coming in at 3 and 1 8 inches. So there's a lot of technologies going into this racket. I'm going to run through the main ones, but if you guys want to check it out, I'll leave a link in the description down below. So the first one is a dynamic optimum frame, which increases the sweet spot. It has a UHB shaft, which increases the flex. A stabilized torsion angle, which reduces the torsion forces when you hit outside of the sweet spot. And finally, it has the classic TB Nano Power Tech, which improves the overall strength by 20% without compromising the weight. Now, let's get an opinion from one of our sponsored coaches, Adam Marcinski. Hi guys, Adam from Racket Champion here, here with the Leaning N90 4th Gen. It's the uh, latest model that they have out right now. And uh, if you're expecting the same thing as the previous uh, N90s, then uh, be surprised because uh, this one is nothing like the previous ones. It's uh, a lot lighter and uh, it leads me to believe that the first three gens were uh, made for Lin Dan. He liked a lot of heavy stuff, whereas this one I suspect is uh, made more for Chen Long. And so this one is quite a bit lighter, more in line with say like the Chen Long uh, N55. And so in that same vein of thought, uh, this one is a much lighter racket, as I said, uh, but still has a lot of power behind it. So uh, there's a lot of control, it takes a little, just a touch to get used to, but once you master that, you can really get a lot of out, out of this racket. So uh, with that being said, I think almost any level of a player can use this. It doesn't take more long to get used to, and you get a lot of uh, oomph out of it. Thank you guys. Thank you Adam so much for your time and for your opinion on this racket. We hope you guys enjoyed this review. Let me know if you guys have tried out or are planning to try out the Leaning N90 4th Edition in the comments down below. We'll see you guys next time.